Hello, Ember. Oh, the dragon. She teleported me. She kidnapped me. Your seed has sprouted. You did well at tending to it, but it will now require one final infusion of mana. Meet me in the sanctuary. Oh, she didn't teleport me. She just contacted me. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. Do you remember, I don't usually send mail outside of Novaria, but I simply had to show you this remarkable basket of blueberries I picked. I managed to get the tree to replenish in only a single hour. You are allowed to eat it. Please enjoy my work, Iris. Blueberries. Okay, I will juice that, actually, later. And okay, that's enough. Awesome. So we're not going to plant here anymore. Let's clean all this up. need to head back to Sunhaven. The animals are like, they're in the way. I can't see this other tree stump. There he goes. They're all just sort of congregating around that. tree there blocking them I see it now I feel like this is also in a bad spot let's put the auto collector somewhere else where is this thing? Auto feeder. Let's put it in the corner and then hopefully they stop getting stuck on it. And then the auto collector. Let's put it down over here. Hopefully they stop getting stuck on it now. Although they look like they're all congregating over here. There's not enough 
food for them. I need more. Oh, I need more of these auto feeders. Okay, so I need to go buy more auto feeders today then. And I need to free these animals. So it looks like if you pick them up, their hearts reset, maybe? They need, we need more food for them. Okay, more auto feeders. Uh, okay. So how many animals do I have? Two, three, two cows, two chickens, two cows, two chickens. That's four, a pig, a sheep, six, my snack coon, seven, a moth, a griffin, and a wood stump. So that's 10. I have three, six, seven. I need three more auto feeders. So we'll just bring more auto feeders. I'm gonna put all my animals. If there are animals from the other place, we're gonna put them here too. So I'll just buy a bunch of auto feeders then. I got a golden milk. Okay. Uh, let's see how he's doing. Oh, these things, some of these things are ready. Good. that I can make into beer with that stuff. Let's eat this and my eggs. <clears throat> so you sell the milk. I don't need snowball crops. Put that in this chest here. And the stuff is going back to Novari. In and Novari, Novari. Now it's for here. Keep these berries. For now, I'll just put the copper in here and we'll sort it out later. And that blueberry stuff can get juiced. Juice it. sell my beer okay so i need um more animal feed stations and i also want to make one of those 
Novari things. We need wheat for that. Novari Totem. An enchanted totem imbued with Novari's mana. It enriches the soil and allows Novari crops to grow in Sunhaven. Novari crops can be planted in Sunhaven within five tiles of this totem. Okay, let's make one. Cool. So I imagine I need one of these acorns for the museum. And maybe one for something else. We'll hold on to it here. In this one, sure. Okay. So I also noticed I need a fishing net. And I'm pretty sure it was one of the big ones. Yeah, I need a big one over here. Ooh, there's raspberries. Golden raspberries here. Ooh, lip lip. Do I need any of these? Maybe, I don't remember. We'll save one. I don't remember. Hmm. What do I need for a fishing net? Water crystals, a bunch of wood planks. Okay, make some more wood planks. All right, when it finishes that, we can make our last fishing net. Let's go get more auto feeders. I wonder if there are auto petters too. Oh, hello. Auto feeders. Uh... I think it's here. Kitty. I want to learn how to fish, but Peter says he doesn't have time to teach me. And Rupert is always too shy to talk to Kitty. Rupert is shy around you? Yep, yep. Whenever I try to talk to him, he gets so embarrassed. He can't even be grumpy. I guess he never learned how to talk to cute girls. <laughs> I guess Rupert likes cats. It's cute, but he still won't teach Kitty how to fish. Why do you want to learn how to fish? Fish is my favorite food. You know that, right? Usually I just fish with my claws, but people using fishing rods catch so much more. <laughs> it's against Kitty's better instinct as an Amari, but I must learn the secret of fishing rods. If you ever learn, we could go fishing. Oh, that's a fun idea. We... Could see who catches the most fish. And then Kitty could eat them. <laughs> sure. Here is an apple. Oh, what a shiny apple. I wish it were a nice juicy fish, though. Hmm. He doesn't sell the auto feeders. Then it must be Town Hall. Another day in Sunhaven, sometimes the days here seem so indistinguishable, but some days are special. Special is today a special day, Claude. I guess you could say that. I'm not used to sharing myself with people, but there's something nice about it, so I want to share something with you, Ember. It's the key to my house. I don't know what to say, Claude. Sure it is. The key to my house is like the key to my life. I want you to know that you're welcome in my life, Ember. Here, take it. 
Do you have any plans for the future? Future, I can't think that far ahead. I'm trying to focus completely on the present. It's the only way I can make music. That's very fitting. It sounds like you mean that as a compliment, so thank you. I think I might be maxed out with Claude. Oh yeah, no hearts. He likes heart. He likes apples too. So I got the key to something. Key to his house. Oh, his keepsake. 400 gold a day. Wow. Let's go, Claude. Hold on a minute. Hold on. All right. E over here. So I think it must be here. Yes. Automatic feeder. I need feeding station. Sell me like another five. House? No. I have an automatic collector. A bar? No. Automatic feeder. I have one. Yeah, I need the feeding stations. So five is definitely enough for now. And so I brought three new pets on the farm. So I have two extras for future pets, future animals. Assuming that Windsor Gate even has animals, which I don't know if it does. Okay. Let's head back and set these up. I like how we all match. Like the sunlight matches the bear and Russell. They all they all match. It's really cool. Okay, let's hook these up for my animals. This is the odd bail out. It's fine. We'll just stick it here. It's fine. You did not just walk in front of that, sir. Please, sir. I grabbed animal feed, but I don't see it. All right, let's free my animals. Okay, how much feed is left in here? hundred and sixty five all right so when those crops finish we're gonna have to plant more wheat seeds all right let's keep looking around the farm see what else is here any other golden fruits don't see any There's a chest. There's a couple of chests down here.
So this is Claude's keepsake. I think I was putting it in there. Where was I sticking it? Here. And I have some ingots. And that's for the elf village. Oh, I wanted to make a another net. I need water crystals for that. Large fishing net, yes. Takes two hours. Okay. It'll finish. We'll get it tomorrow or something. Let's see. Oh, that's not done yet. Okay. All right, when this finishes, we'll start planting um, Navari crops here. He looks stuck. You know what, this guy, we'll just take him to Navari. He's not needed here. And he's one of the ugly ones. <laughs> he could live on the beach, that's fine. He's too ugly to be on the main farm. It's not my fault. Hmm. So all the animals are good now. They all have food. And... It's like Tiny's going to drop a golden something tomorrow. You look like you need to be freed. He's stuck in there. He can't get out. There you go, buddy. Okay, okay, cool. I might need another winter scarecrow. We'll see. I might need more scarecrows. It depends. If this Novari scarecrow takes up the range of like the whole side here. Then I'll have to put a scarecrow there and a scarecrow there to protect both farms. Which means I'll need an extra scarecrow. Right now I have three spring scarecrows. Three summer, three fall, three winter. They're down here. One, two, three summers. One, two, three springs. One, two, three falls. And then the three winters I'm currently using. But I think I have an extra... An extra fall one, actually, I got from a quest, and I put it over there. Yeah. But I only have three springs and three summers. And three winters. Mm, okay. Well, we'll worry about that later. So there's no reason for me to go back to Novari... Unless I want to talk to the dragon. Sure, let's go talk to the dragon then. Let's go keep progressing the main story. And then you can live here. It's so nice that these things spawn out here like that. Let's donate all of my mana. Including my mana passive. It's the money. And then let's go see the dragon.
This winter, I hope to do some serious research into which plants grow best. Ooh. Everybody likes apples. Not that way. So we'll camp out here again for the night. Welcome, Ember. The final steps of your journey are about to be taken. Iris and even Van have both agreed to aid you in this, and it will take the efforts of each of you to, fi to finish fully infusing the crystal. What are Iris and Van doing here? Single tree may grow strong, but it is not a forest. Even with your considerable power, it would be a tremendous task to infuse these crystals alone. The infusion of these mana gems is sacred tradition in Novari, and it can only be properly completed with a truly massive amount of mana. Ember, did you need to borrow some muscles? I'm here to help. I would never miss the opportunity to be part of something as special as this. I am glad to help. What do we need to do? All you need to do is infuse the crystals as you would anything else it will not be merely your own energy iris and van will be there with you your energy cannot overpower or be overpowered it must all flow together balanced you understand have it under control just do your best i think we are capable of that let's try our best everyone Combine your powers and let it bring growth. Our infusions were closely balanced. We may need more help. We could do it. Let's try again. Hello, Ember. I figured my help would be needed. Wesley, you're here to help? I would be. Honored to help with you in this ceremony. Three has become four. Try again and infuse a flower with your energy. Would you look at that? We did it. Well done, all of you. Each of you see the world in very different ways, but by putting yourselves together, you were able to achieve something truly remarkable. Was there something you wanted to say? Thank you. The growing of these mana crystals is an important piece of Navari's culture and history now, and, and it's important to me, so thank you. You're welcome. What was accomplished here could not have been done without all of you. If just one of you were missing, then the others would have all failed. Well done, I'm proud of you all. Iris and Van, thank you both for the help. Now, I would like to say a few things to Wesley and Ember. Yes, Nervara. Thank you for everyone for this. It was good to be a part of it. Van says nothing but winks with a smirk before quietly taking his leave. Remember, when you came to Novari and stood before me, I told you that Helios believed there was an incredible potential inside of you. I think you have more than proven his brief, his belief correct. You have done very, very well, and I am very proud. Wesley, someday you will be elder. When Ember first arrived, you had problems accepting their presence in Novari. Yes, World Dragon. But you have grown much. Take this growth to heart and continue to nurture it. Do this, and you will make a great elder when the time comes. I understand. Thank you. And thank you, Ember. 
Ember, I now wish to ask you one more thing of you. What is it? Please close your eyes and clear your mind. I wish for you to receive my blessing. Yes, give me power. It is done. Helio spoke true. There is an energy about you. Strange and familiar. Now, remember my lessons and let them guide and grow you further. And while I have no more immediate lessons for you, if you ever need my wisdom, please come speak to me again. Good luck in your adventures. I trust you and know that there is no darkness you cannot overcome. Thank you for teaching me. Okay. I got bonus mana, orbs, bonus farming experience. And then I can choose gems, mana gem seeds. Mana gems take eight days to grow and sell for money. I have elemental seeds, wind chime seeds, acorn seeds. Okay, we'll take the three mana seeds then. Can I harvest this? Little Sprout, what brings you to me? Tell me more about what you do here. Certainly, when I first discovered the elves, they were capable people, but they were spiritually lost. I made it my responsibility to maintain nature's balance wherever I go, so when I saw the elves in need, I had no choice but to help. Over time, I witnessed their impact on the forest here. Their efforts go further than they know, as nature is a cascade of cause and effect. So I remain in my sanctuary here to guide the cascade and maintain harmony. With your guidance, it is no wonder the forest is so bountiful. This forest is certainly a special place. I have chosen it because of the elves' immense influence on this part of the world. They deserve every bit as much credit as I do. I want to know more about you. There is much to tell, much more than can reasonably be told. I was born here, hatched in the branches of the Grand Tree. I grew up quickly and realized that I wish to preserve and protect the natural order of the world. I want to nurture life, though I also want life to go along its natural course with as little interference as possible. Do you understand what I mean? I think I get it. I thought you would. Helios has always wanted to guide life more directly to bring one's potential out right away. That is his way. I prefer to let life bring its own potential out. Our differences do not make us opposed to one another. We have different ways of seeing the world, which makes us valuable allies as we work together. Okay. Thank you. I'll be leaving now. So now what? Now I have to travel to the northern forest. So I have to go north now. Okay. I imagine north is actually through the east. There was also this like um, castle outside that was guarded by a king slime boss. I never did go around and talk to those people. Maybe we'll do that next time. The snow is serene and beautiful. I want everyone in Elvari to experience it. An apple tastes all the sweeter it comes from you. Don't mention it, Van. My man. Van the man. Van the stampede. Hee <laughs> hee. There were some mines over here. Let's see about that. What's the trick to this? Is this part of a quest? Do I have to convince this guy to let me in? I also have a sunlight key for this thing. It gave me a tree. Okay. And a uh, morning's light ring, attack speed. Okay, sure. 
Have another have a night ring. Okay. Hey, let me pass. Wesley, tell Wilt only key people allowed inside. Do you have the key? I have a key. Hmm, what key? Oh, I need a key. These deep mines go under Novari long ways. Grand tree roots move each day. Block and unblock different mines. Each day a different mine opens. Can be ruins, flower, mushroom, or beehive. Each mine has three different size floors. Better keys give better chance of bigger floor size, which mean more resources to mine. If you leave, mine floor will be lost. We'll have to give Wilt another key to answer again. Wesley, tell everyone the key people are not on side. So you need a key and then you can do mining in there. Okay. Well, it seems like you need to do that if you want the stone. Hmm. Okay, I think before we progress further in the main quest, we'll do some Novari stuff. There are Novari crops to be grown. And there's the Novari mines. And there's some stuff around the forest of Novari that I haven't really explored either. For now, we can go back and keep clearing the stuff off the farm which will give resources and free up space. We'll do that for the rest of the day. Getting late. Chop it all down. everything
Yeah, it looks good. Everything's cleared up. Good night.